said mark on the forehead for people that sign in that crime. I'm gonna get that. Let's get that script. Hey, get that, Daryl. Why get these signs? You don't have pull that script out, read us. It's going you got scream at the top of your lungs. Like goddamn fish, you smell that? Some yeah, rotten yeah, pussy yeah, just coming with me. That was probably a lot of cookouts. But I'll tell you what's going on back there. So everything's going on back there. I bet that's probably one of the fat bitches pussy. Yeah, we get a no new group of freshmen this year. They come to this motherfucker and they find out they get a quarter shot when they see us out here. Well, anyway, whether they like it or not, they get more. Whether they down with this bullshit, or they men that's signing in that crime. We don't give a damn about the women. They, they, they're clueless to what's going on. Yeah, the fuck. The woman, there's nothing you can do to a woman with just fuck a bitch. That's all she's good for. They ain't trying to teach a woman. We ain't gonna try to read scriptures to a woman. I mean, we might read it to a, we might read a bitch of scripture just to have a good lesson. You know what I'm saying? That's the only reason why. But we ain't actually trying to enlighten a woman because a woman is not enlightened. She can't learn anything. That's true, man. These bitches are retarded as hell. These bitches, like I said, all the only thing they're good for is fucking pussy. That's it. And then on top of that, if you fuck one of these hoes, you gotta be careful. You'll catch a disease. Oh, go ahead. Romans 16 and 17. Now beseech you, brethren, mark them which cause divisions and offenses contrary to the doctrine which ye have learned and avoid them. So people people always say, how come y'all talk bad about people? The Bible said to mark those who cause division. You're supposed to mark them. You're supposed to expose them. Okay? I'll keep going. I'll read that. Yeah, yeah, because people get mad when we talk shit about people. Well, the Bible talks shit about people. It, the Lord said he's angry at the wicked every day. Keep going. For they that are set serve not our Lord, but their own belly. That's why that's America. These, these American retards, all they do is they serve their own belly. That's all they care about is feeding themselves and fulfilling their physical needs or their wants. They don't need shit. The only thing they need is to be destroyed by fire. That's what they need. Who is wearing a fucking kitten shirt? That's gay as hell, man. That's some of the faggotiest shit I've seen yet. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. So you see a faggot, you're supposed to mark that faggot. Right? Look, you're a faggot. All right. We we see you. We know who you are. We know what you're about. You're a goddamn faggot. And we don't want you nowhere near us. Uh, keep going. And by good words and fair speeches, deceive the hearts of the simple. Yeah, I mean, that, that, that sums up all these preachers and all these politicians, too. It sums them up perfectly. Yeah, that's perfect. Like, all these politicians that give a perfect speech, they don't never use any cuss words, but they're responsible for millions of deaths, like Barack Obama, that faggot. He give up there, give a beautiful speech. He speak, he give one of the best speeches you ever heard. He give you a butterflies in your stomachs. But behind, but, but, but when the camera's turned off, he's dropping bombs on little children. You know what I'm saying? He said he drone striking whole families. That's what Obama's doing. Oh yeah, behind closed doors, Obama's listening to every last one of your phone calls that you make. Whatever sophisticated mm. surveillance they have. Because I heard through them cable boxes, some cable boxes, they got a, it's an eye in there, a cable box. Yeah. The cell phones, they, I heard that uh, even if it's turned off, they can still listen to it. Red lights on. 
That's like having Hal up in your house. Like you ever seen that movie 2001 Space Odyssey? Yeah, that's 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 who's, yeah, that's who's running shit is Hal. You know what I'm saying? Especially if you got like a Windows computer in your house. If you got a Windows operating system or you got an Apple computer, they spawn your ass for sure. They got your ass. Uh, this is Ezekiel 9 and 4. And the Lord said unto him, go through the midst of the city, through the midst of Jerusalem. So that's what we're doing right now. We're in the midst of the city right now. Keep going. And set a mark upon the foreheads of the men that signed and that cried. Uh, yeah, notice we're in the midst of the city. You see all these people out here. We're not out like a, back in some back alley in the neighborhood. You know what I'm saying? We are hiding, hiding in a dark alley, or up, uh, hiding in the back of a park. My, on my backyard. Yeah, or up in the <laughs> backyard doing a video. I mean, you can do videos in your backyard, but... Right, right. Well, you got a lot of people that just straight up bitches, they scared to go teach. That's where they primarily go. Yeah, they go to... Like, I watch videos, motherfuckers be out there teaching in the park. Teaching the two squirrels and a bird. Keep going. And set a mark upon the foreheads of the men that sign and that cry for all the abominations that be done in the midst thereof. So yeah, so we're not even looking for just anybody. We're only looking for the people to sign and cry. And you look around, that's, you don't see nobody sign and crying. You know what I'm saying? Happy. Look at all these happy motherfuckers, man. They all look like a bunch of happy faggots, man. Yo, oh, I'm a freshman. We're starting a new school year at Ohio State. My daddy gave me some money. I'm gonna go smoke some crack and do some uh, some beer bongs up my ass. What's that called? Butt chugging? Fucking bagging. Secure their future. They're claiming the future, hey. They don't envision America going down, man. These people are going, man. You fucking see a storm. You see that motherfucking big ass storm style coming. Yeah. You take a cover. That's just fucking common goddamn sense. You can see it. The birds are flying around. You can smell it. You know what I mean? You can smell a, 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 a storm from a distance. These people don't see shit, don't know shit. They're gonna be, when there's no food in the stores, it's gonna be different then. They're gonna be crying like the little bitches that they are. Right. And to the others, he said, in my hearing, go ye after him through the city and smite. <laughs> Let not your eyes spare. Neither have ye pity. So that's what the Lord says. Soon the Lord's gonna just be killing fools, man. That's what's coming. It goes with the Jeremiah 16, so. the, the Lord said when he come back, he gonna he gonna tread the wine press. His his garments is gonna be covered in, in blood. Yeah. It's a massacre. I mean that's what a bloody city gets though. Like the scripture said, woe to the bloody city. You you gonna you gonna you gonna get what you did to all these people double. You gonna get paid back double for all your crimes. You going? Slay federal, old and young. So all these old ass bitches, they gonna get slayed. All these little evil little children that are raised by these single mothers, they gonna get slayed, they gonna get killed. Okay? The Lord ain't gonna spare you, man. He ain't gonna spare none of these wicked little demons. Keep going. Both maids and little children. Because there is such thing as little evil children. Okay, little evil children do exist. The scripture said the wicked are estranged from the womb as soon as they be born speaking lies. So as soon as one of these little devils is born, they born speaking lies. Hey, read that again. They brought future slavery too. Slay utterly, old and young. Especially all these little rich little white little babies, little demons. Like you see all these little rich little white kids come to the school. They, they've never had it bad their entire life. Had everything handed to them. They're all faggots. They all look like homosexuals and talk like girls. Just little, little soft bitches, man. They're going to get slayed. And their children are going to get slayed by the Lord. They're going to get butchered. They're going to get butchered. You know, you oh, fuck. Don't, don't, don't tell me this. Shit. Oh, shit. You're booed. You cut your grass and that lawnmower just doing, he doing a precision cut. What's up, homie? A precision up, homie? cut. That's how we're gonna run through two thirds. 
Because two thirds gonna get ran over with a lawnmower. You see all these big scams. You got here, audience back, huh? You out here trying to get you some of some little fresh pussy coming yeah, I'm in? I'm trying to find me some weed, man. Shit. I'm trying to find you some it. weed? Shit. Well, this is the best shit you can smoke right here. Yeah. These scriptures. No, oh, yeah. Not, yeah, put this in. The pipe, What's that saying? Put this in your pipe and smoke it. <laughs> oh, really? That's right, brother. What's up, man? Hey, Kenny Road, over to you to downtown. How long y'all been out here? Oh, we just got here. For real? Yeah, we just got here. Probably, what we've been looking for. It ain't crowded enough for us. More people, the better. There's a lot of bitches out here, ain't it? A lot of bitches. A lot of, a lot of pussy. Snatching these hoes up soon, man. Watch. I doubt that. You've been saying that for years. So, watch. Soon, soon women gonna be currency. Soon, it, soon when the American dollar loses its value, we're gonna use women for currency. Yeah, you weren't ready for that, was you? That's that's gonna be the new currency. Women, oil, women, oil, gasoline, food. That's that's real money. Food is real money. Gasoline's real money. Women is real money. That's money. You know what I'm saying? Well, gold's money too. That's real money. Especially when this chaos jump off. These women, I mean, it's different. What's the word I'm looking for? Calamity. 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 They're going to become a home. They're going to be a, oh, you talking about, uh, like, they gonna be a. It's another word for like having something to buy, like having money. Oh, they're they a commodity. A commodity, that's it. They're going to be a commodity. Yeah. Well, that's what they're going to be. Yeah. You know all the words in the dictionary too? I, I don't know all the words. No, no. You can't possibly learn all the words. <laughs> just read them. I just read it from the beginning to end. Yeah, I mean, I do that sometimes. I just stay up and read, study words. Really? Snatch you one of these little girls walking yet? Huh? They've been here. They, they've been coming in what since Friday? Uh, yeah. I'm since like Thursday years Friday? Older. Huh? Thirty years older than the oldest girl out here. That's that's even better. Not really. That's what you want is a young, fresh piece of pussy. Now, when you go to the store and you buying fruits and vegetables, do you be looking for the for the old bruised up vegetables and the beat up ones? No. You get the freshest produce possible. It's got to be fresh. You know what, what I'm saying? What you said, the young girl don't want some old. Um, it doesn't old matter what she wants. It ain't really? about what a bitch wants. It's about what she needs. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah. You know, a woman has no wants. A woman is property. So, that's the way. Yeah. Let me get this. Okay. Slight early, old and young, both maid and little children. And women. So, the Lord gonna be killing old women. He gonna be killing children. That's, that's in the Bible. But, sometimes you hear anything. You ever hear one of, one of Jesus' preachers teaching that one? You ain't ever heard no church read that scripture before. They ain't gonna touch it. They ain't, actually, they ain't gonna touch most of the Bible, actually. I haven't been to church since I was what? That's good. Elementary school? That's it. That's it. That's good. Yeah, yeah. Let's stay away from that place. You fuck around getting molested going to one of these churches. <laughs> then, yo, know, they rape your kids. Yeah, you got that right. Yeah, the preacher will be fucking your wife, raping your children. No. That's a black church. Uh, white church. Oh, it don't happen in black churches or something? Yeah, yeah, don't fuck your wife. Eddie Long was. You heard about Eddie Long came out? He was fucking little boys. Oh, yeah, Eddie he's Long. a black minister. Yeah, he was one of the biggest preachers yeah. in America. Yeah. He got came out. He was having some fucking little boys in the ass. Yeah. And then that, his congregation forgave him. Forgave they said him. Jesus forgives you. Is he still preaching? Yeah, yeah, he's, he's still preaching. He's, he's making he's millions. Larger than any other time. That's larger. Interesting. He's more popular now. But is, is he national or something? Yeah, he's huge. Up? Eddie Long, Eddie Long's That's messed up. That's kind of Because you know what? What they uh, did, they suppressed it in the news. Because, because instead of going to trial and yeah, challenging the, the, uh, yeah, the uh, yeah. accusations, <laughs> he settled out of court. Really? He said he's going to fight this to the end. He said, I'm going to fight this to the end. He settled out of court millions. Hey, you heard about Elmo fucking little boys, didn't you? Who's Elmo? Elmo from Sesame Street. 
Elmo. The, the, pup, the puppeteer who does, the guy who does the voice for Elmo, yeah, he, act, he got caught fucking little boys. Yeah, yeah, no, the, the puppeteer. Voice, dude, somebody actually, that's a voice. Yeah, it's a, that's a voice. There's only one dude that does the voice of Elmo. Oh, all right. I, yeah. what's his, I forget his name. Uh, oh, yeah, was, uh, man, he I actually got, he was fucking little boys in the ass. And that's the who. The guy who plays Elmo. I meant to tell you, I'm sorry, what you say his name was Darren? I mean, wait, Darren. Darren, I'm sorry. He was laughing at you when you was reading that thing by Shakespeare. Remember the 46 lines down? That's true. Oh, no, no. Really? He was holding you laugh back, man. Yeah, because I didn't know it. That was Oh, shit. That's just really? one of those secrets. You're just reading into that, man. No, I'm not. That's a secret? It's a secret. He purposely put it on the 46 line on two different pages. It's on the same chapter. Psalm 46. Really? Yeah, I learned about it from, uh... I was reading... Uh, Oxford English history to English language or something. They had it was in there. So he, he kind of predicted you were gonna die at the age of 46. I don't know. No, no, no. He was 46 when he did the work on it. When he was working on it, he was 46. Well, how old was he when he died? I don't know. He, he didn't make it too long. All right. You know if y'all an Edomite, so-called white man, you know your future is slavery. You know that? Your future is slavery. You're That's some nice little snow bunnies right here. Anybody ever told any of you white people that? It's like payback for what y'all did to the so-called Negro and Native Americans. Oh. Slave! <laughs> Goddamn devils! Hey, moving on the coat of us. Some weird shit going on down here, man. But come not near any man upon whom is the mark. We begin at my sanctuary. That's why. That's why we out here. We out here marking people. Just like. Well, just like the scripture said. If anybody out here signing and crying for the abomination, you're supposed to put a mark on them. We got teaching the Bible. That's the mark. We ain't gonna actually take a. We're gonna pull out a sharpie and put a check mark on your head. And see, most people out here, they, 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 they good with being a slave. They enjoy paying taxes. They enjoy being a fucking faggot. They, they're good with faggots walking around everywhere. Fucking lesbians everywhere. Transsexuals. They, they enjoy a Elmo raping their child. They good with that shit, man. Uh, Jeremiah 16 and 16. Behold, I will send for many fishers, said the Lord, and they shall fish them. Yeah, uh, yeah, we out here fishing. I know you heard the old Baptist song, the old gospel song, Fishers of Men. You heard that old saying, I'm going to make you fishers of men. That's from the gospel. When the Lord, he told you, I'm going to make you fishers of men. So we out here fishing for people. That's the same thing as we putting marks on people. We marking people. Keep going. Yeah. Uh, we just find, I mean, we just have publishing the word, man. Right. Whether they hear, whether they forbear. Right. And after will I send for many hunters, and they shall hunt them from every mountain and from every hill and out of the holes of the rock. Yes, right now we're just teaching these fools. But soon we're we going to be hunting. We're going to be killers. The Lord going to put the spirit on us. He's going to give us spiritual power. We're going to get our superpowers. You say soon? Soon. 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 What's the definition of soon? Oh, soon, <laughs> soon? Soon is soon. Soon is soon. Soon is soon. It ain't going to be, be like we're going to be out this motherfucker. Uh, soon. I'm, I'm, look, I'm soon. in my mid-40s. You don't know, I, man. We ain't going to be out here till I'm 60. I mean, you don't know. Don't nobody know the, the time of the Lord. When he going to do what he's got to do? Soon. You know what I'm saying? People say, see you soon. That means... It's going to be soon I mean, enough. When that happens, it's going to be soon, soon enough then. That's right. You know what I mean? But when it, when it ha actually happens, and then it's going to be it's gonna be past soon. It's going to be now. You know what I'm saying? Right. For real. Man, this is crowded out here, man. God damn. What you going to do, what you gonna do when you see chariots coming out of the sky? Huh? You're you going to shit yourself. No, I just going to look at them. Your mouths know. is going to empty. You, man, come on, man. Let's be realistic. When you see them giant things in the sky, you ain't you can't ignore that. Huh? Let's just be realistic, man. I am being you realistic. You can't ignore no chariots just flying around. I am being realistic. And all, all these goddamn dumbass sheep that's walking around like nothing's they going get, on. They're going to get fried they up. They're going to be terrified. They're going to get burned up. Some are going to drop dead from fear. 
but the but most I can put that spear right back in him. Wake your ass up, motherfucker. That's your 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 destiny is to burn in a motherfucking fire. You know? That's, that's what's gonna happen. Right so right. Those who are chosen to go up, what happens to them? You say there's no hell, right? It, well, yeah. Well, hell is that that destruction that's coming. That, that nuclear destruction. That's hell. Actually, living in this shit is hell. This shit is torture. Living in this shit. You gotta put up with all these faggots and adulterous ass women. Oh, man. You gotta. You can't, you can't say shit. You can't do shit. Yeah, you can't even say like if a bitch cheats on you, and takes your children and lays up with another man, and another man is up in your house with your children. You should have the right to put him to death. There's nothing, there's no discussion. He needs to die, and she needs to die with him. Because that's the most evil thing you could ever possibly do. That's one of the most, the big, that's one of the biggest sins you fucking commit. Fucking adultery, man. Right. Come on. Commit adultery. What the fuck fucking adultery, that? man. What the fuck is fuck by us? A freak. A nappy headed hoe. Down with those snowmen. I don't white. And why these faggots, if they hear me saying uh, you gotta kill an adulterous woman, you'll call the cops on us. We're gonna have cops. We'll have cops out here before the day's over, right there. <laughs> you think so? Yeah, yeah. They're gonna be like, y'all out here talking about killing women, and then we'll, we'll tell them it's in the Bible. Or they'll be like, oh, it's in the Bible, you're good. That's what they'll say. You know what I'm saying? Give me some more, bro. For my eyes are upon all their ways. So, they are not hid from my so face. The, so the Lord sees all you faggots and adulterous women out here. Y'all gonna get burned up in that lake of fire, which is America getting destroyed. Oh, okay. These bitches come here, man, as freshmen, just coming into the world. Man, before they even got here, they've been experiencing hopes. But they come here because they hear about the great parties. Oh, what you have. You know what I mean? Come on, when I first got out of high school, we came here because we heard about what's going on down this yeah, They got a cop right there. You know, we heard about the, the party and the good times they're having down here. Don't you mean Ohio University? Oh, it's you. Oh, huh? Ohio University, that's in Athens. Well, Athens, too. We heard about Athens, too. That's, that's well, they number party. parties come down here, man. Yeah, I know. They number parties going on down here. It's a big party. It's a big orgy. <laughs> you know? And then these bitches act like they're all pure and they're all beautiful. He's ready to butt chug. Right, butt chugging. Who the fuck? Man. All these bitches making butt pornos. Chug. They All these women make pornos. Make how, how, do you how do you think most of these bitches, I know a lot of their parents are rich, but not all their parents, a lot of these bitches, they get money for school. For uh, being a stripper, stripper being a prostitute. You know, if you're a stripper, you're a prostitute. You, you don't know. Don't never be dating no stripper woman. You know what I mean? Sure, you fuck around, and get gonorrhea, catch AIDS or something. Really? All, every obvious, last one of you. Just, Somebody, could, you come with the white. Right, you come with a stack of cheddar. That bitch see this. It's on. Yeah, because that's the only thing a stripper bitch is good for is money. She'll Everybody buy you everything. Probably the guy with money. So she's working for money. Yeah. So she's selling her body for money. That's why she's advertising that stinking woman. For money, Cause for, he, it, cause for he, and then these men, they'll be like, they, they'll actually think a stripper bitch ain't being a prostitute, and that she don't go back in the champagne room. You know what I mean? Man, they, they, they don't. Talking about my baby, my girl, she's different. She just strips. She, she don't be doing that. You have a daughter too? Huh? You have a daughter? No, I'm talking about. That's what people say. Huh. I, I, I fucked with the stripper bitches before. Really? And they're all prostitutes. Okay. Oh, right. You know, you see an athlete, man. People are in awe. You see Michael Jordan. People are in awe. Just like when a man see a porn star, they see a porn star, they stuff like someone's stupid. It don't even come to their mind, it don't even strike a thought in their mind that, damn, that bitch got a, 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 million, a million net wars going on inside of her, man. She got the war of Armageddon going on inside her pussy right there. She got the valley of truth, the valley of sperm gathering. Sperm gathering. You know, the valley of nut sperm. after nut. You yes, know, yes, the yes, valley. Yes, yes. Right the war of Armageddon going on these bitches pussy, man. Right in between That's why it stinks. Because there's death going on inside that bitch. Goes to yoga club. That's straight up witchcraft, that yoga bullshit. Yeah, yoga is witchcraft, you know that? That's straight up witchcraft. Yeah, Alistair, you know who Alistair Crowley is? Who? Alistair Crowley, he's like the biggest devil worshiper in history. But this dude, he, he, he wrote whole books on yoga. And how, you, if you want to uh, summon up some, some demons and some spirits, first you got to do yoga for a certain period of time. The yoga is going to open up your chakras and your spirit to let them demons come in. What's, what's your boy uh, who uh, come up with uh, Scientology? Yeah, uh, uh, Hubbard. You know, he was Hubbard a Hubbard. large believer in uh, your boy. Uh, uh, Crowley, yeah, 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 of course. Your boy that come uh, up with Scientology? Yeah. He was a, a follower of Alex, Alistair Crowley. Now, them motherfuckers is nuts. 
Scientology, they think this shit just, they think the chariots is coming for them. <laughs> they sure do. They, they just, you ain't see that just came out of the news, they built an airstrip for chariots to land. Oh, they seen that. You seen that? Hell yeah, I seen that. They ain't spending big money on it too. Who built it? They ain't know the building, Say you name? see the building? Yeah. Who, wait, who built it? The, the Scientologists, they built a giant runway where the spaceships could land. That don't mean But that the, the spaceships don't, the chariots don't need a runway. That don't mean the chariots Ain't no chariot gonna touch this dirty ass planet. Hell no. Ain't no chariot gonna touch this earth, man. Check it out. And know, um, he's a large, he's a large follower of uh, Alice Crowley's uh, beliefs, right? And guess it just came out, and the, and the videos is on YouTube, Farrakhan is pushing Scientology. Yeah, Farrakhan, he's out of his mind. That old fool gone, man. That old fool gone. Man? Sorry, I told you. Your girl that came out that was on the show, King of New York, that pretty Italian chick. My girl? Uh, <laughs> nah, I come ain't got no girl. Yeah, you, nah, oh, you know the movie, uh, the, the show that used to come on, King of New York. King oh, of Queens. King oh, of Queens. Oh, no, I never watched it. Oh, that chick. All right. King of Queens. That chick came out and she... She said she left that. She's leaving that Scientology church alone. Oh, I know. Now to get her. Leah, something. She looks good. Yeah. Yeah, she looks nice. She looks good, man. She coming out against him. And she went to the police and said that one of the followers' wives is coming up missing. And they can't find her. They said they told her, man, just leave it alone. But it been the Scientologists, they got caught with the. That's a serious They got like slave plantations. Dude's about to go butt chug. Yeah, they look like a bunch of homies. What's up, bro? You believe in the Bible? You read the Bible? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but you're a Christian. That's cool. The Lord, what color is the Lord? Huh? What color is the Lord? What, like what color is the Lord? Uh, I don't know. You don't know what? <laughs> I have no idea. So you never knew he was a black man? I have no idea. The Lord, yeah, it's in the scripture. You, right? you, have you read the Bible? Yeah. It's in the Bible. You didn't see it in there that uh, the Lord is black? The Most High Himself, who the world called God, black man. I think he, he runs to us, uh, the black, the white, the yellow, the different Yeah, but here, I'll show you in the Bible. Yeah. But it, it, it matters though, because there's so many lies been told. That picture, that's a lie. Yeah. That's an idol. It only, it's a lie, it's an idol also. A false image. But you know what it says? Yeah. What does the second commandment say? Oh, the second commandment, the Ten Commandments. Why I can't believe he's a black, black, Oh, go and read that. Uh, read that. Oh, uh, Revelations 1 and 14. His head and his hairs were white like wool. Does he have white woolly hair? Is that white woolly hair? That's long, that's long and doggy hair. That's gold, there's more gold in it. Reddish. Go ahead, bro. And his white as snow, and his eyes were as a flame of fire. This is a blue-eyed devil. His eyes, the Bible said right here, the Lord had red eyes. Okay, bro. And his feet like on two fine brass. Hey, what color, you know what color fine brass is? Brass, what color is brass? How about chocolate? As if they burned in a furnace. Some burnt brass, not just regular brass, some burnt brass. You took some brass and burned it. It's going to be a very dark reflection. Right, especially when you put it in the fire. You got a penny? A penny. That's brass. A penny. Who are those people there? The American Negro? This saying right here? The Which 12 one are tribes. West Indians, the Haitians, the Dominicans. It's all Israelites. Those Israelites. Those people. Those people. 12 tribes. Hey, look. I'll, I'll, get, I'll get you a scripture to prove that all the Israelites were originally black people. I'll, I'll prove it to you. I'm going to show you a scripture. What's your nationality? What's your nationality? Well, there's a lot of us. They mix in Nigeria. Yeah. Because you ain't got a, a normal Nigerian spirit on you anyway. No. <laughs> hey, check it out, bro. Hey, yo. You, uh, you read the Bible? Not really. Do you believe in the Lord? Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, I got a That's scripture. A Look, I'm gonna show you a scripture. It's a starter. It's gonna prove that all the Israelites were black people at first, and that actually uh, to have white skin means you got caught a case of leprosy. Okay. So white people are evil. Not no, all, I, I didn't say see, that. Not all white people are the same. Well, white, just like not all black people are the same. Just because you got black skin don't make you a one of these. 
right. gonna make you a black, a so-called Negro. It ain't, it ain't all saying? about skin color. It's about who you're right. It's about your seed and your lineage. About who? The lowest people in, in home are people of Negro and Indian descent and Latinos. Watch you, know, it. you know about Scottish people? Of course, yeah. You know about I mean, Irish? I know. The only reason I'm saying is that I'm, I, mean, I can trace my village down right. to like, where my ancestors came from. Where your ancestors come from? They're from Africa. I've been down to my village. Well, they've probably been down there for a while. So, we was we was taking all kind of pussy from, from the real Hamites. Uh, you know, you know. American Negroes are from Africa, West Africa, okay. West India. No, the American oh. Negroes not from West Africa. We're from Africa. No, we fled into West Africa. Africa. <laughs> Asians are African because all of them worship our gods. If you go to Haiti right now, a lot of them. This let me ask you. Voodoo. That came and, from and, West and, Africa. And, let me yes, ask you a question. In okay. Northern Africa. The Northern America, Brazil, Brazilians that come from listen, West Africa. Listen. So. Let me ask you a question. In Northern and Western you Africa. You're telling Israelite. And listen. In Northern and Western Africa, before Islam took over, what did everybody believe in over there? Before Islam. I mean, they had their gods. They had their own gods. But they, most of them was Christian. Okay. okay. Yeah, they, they were. were. They Northern Africa. I'm from Africa. Have you been there? No, I have not okay, personally. Then. You speak with someone who's been there, lived there. I'm no, not, I'm, I'm talking. I'm talking history. I'm no, talking. No, actually, this is years there. Actually, how, how this, are you this, this Bible. I'm 31 authority. years old. I've lived over there. I'm, so, I'm just, you know. I'm this say, Bible is authority. What's coming out your mouth, man? It's wrong. There ain't no authority in that bullshit. Well, because first of all, these Bible people ain't from Africa. Bad. First of all, yeah, uh, holy men, holy men. They, first of all, these people ain't from Africa. Africa. You know what holy men are? Yeah, we're holy men. Yeah, we're, right. we're holy we're men. Scholars. But anyway, like first of all, these people ain't from Africa. We what? fled into Africa at a certain point of history. We, not we fled so into Africa. What's that guy? What's that Galatia? Uh, uh, right, let me get it. No, hell no, we're going to fucking doo doo land. Doo doo eat Why is he doo doo land? Why is he doo doo land? He doesn't eat shit. They do eat shit. Because they eat shit. They eat shit. You ain't never seen the Africans walk around with the doo doo catchers that they hold. They got little pouches they put on their ass. So when they shit, I just picked they, a hundred dollars from off the tree. Listen, bro. Listen, listen. Yeah, in Africa, Africa, that's what they believe. Over here, it's paved with gold. They pick out money from trees. Here you go. That's Galatians four and twenty six. Galatians four and twenty six. But true. Jerusalem, which is above, is free. Which is the mother of us all. Jerusalem is the motherland. We mother ain't from land. no ain't no fucking Africa, no motherland, man. That's falsehood. So where are you That's from? just miseducation that this devil is teaching us. We're from Jerusalem. The real where, Jews, where that land of Israel is our land. These is these people land. Oh, this is and the real Israelites ain't in Jerusalem. Black is from Africa. No, no, everybody black ain't from no, no Africa. No, no. Everybody, no, no. the life started in Jerusalem. Who taught you that? It started in Jerusalem. I know that. Who taught you that? You ain't never read the book of Genesis? The first step. You ever read the book of Genesis? The book of Genesis talks about the book of Genesis talks about the beginning of every nation. It was written by man. That right there was written by man. You know that? You know how long? How many? You know how many times was translated? Let me ask you a question. Who was translated? You don't understand what he's saying. You don't understand what you're saying, man. You ain't going anywhere. Let me ask you a question. What was the original people who wrote the airplane? Let me ask you a question. What was originally written then? What's the language? It was written in Hebrew, bro. Let me ask you a question. What happened to it? It was converted. The process, process, process of conversion is like, if I was to convert somebody, right? If you tell me a story and I convert that story, I'm going to put in my own words. A lot of people are going to get missing. I told you oh, that. I know, I'm telling you. So, we, 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 I'm not, we read, I'm, read the Hebrew. I, I know you were too. I, I read the Hebrew. What? We, we study the Hebrew Bible. We study the Greek Bible. Yeah, but I'm just saying it's written by man. I mean, it's written by man. I'm trying to. It's yeah, yeah, really the book We're from Af every black person, whether you like it or not, you're from Africa. I'm That's retarded. That. That's retarded. That's retarded. That's retarded. That's retarded. That's retarded. How are you going to prove that? You can't prove that. What? You can't prove that you're from Africa. Because every person has their gene of a black woman. Okay, let me ask you a question. Let me read them. Let me read them. There's white people. There's white people. There's white people in South Africa. There's white people. South Africa. There's a bunch of English and Dutch people living in South Africa. Uh huh. How the hell do they get there? They migrated there. Well, from no Spain. shit. They from migrated Spain. there. Migrated so why Spain. can't other people migrate? No, because. Oh, so uh, so black people aren't allowed to migrate. Imagine, why did you black people are dark in the first place? Because they're, they're black. Every nation at the beginning was dark. Originally, uh, uh, every nation was dark at the beginning. Was not, the reason why we're dark, every nation was not. The only reason why we're human beings were. were why, why do you become dark? The products of our environment. If you know anything about Africa, Africa is hot. Africa is hot. Africa Africa is hot. The only reason why our hair is woolly is okay. because the hot sun. Then, then how come? Okay. That's okay. our nature. How come? 
the how darkness come? of our skin is comes from the how co come? color of the hot African skin. That, that's why you have some black Mexicans. Why do you have some black Mexicans? Thank you. Look at Asians. It's the same thing. What about Eskimos? Eskimos are black. Eskimos living up in that cold ass Yeah, but they're blacker than you. Look at the hair. But they're blacker than you. No, they're not. They're darker than you. How do they get so dark? They're darker than you. Eskimos are not dark. I guarantee you. How do they get dark? They're darker than the Vikings. They're darker than the Vikings. Their skin is a little bit tinted, but they're not dark. Then how come how come Eskimos? I moved to Europe and stayed here for hundreds of years. Yeah. My kids are gonna start looking white. Now, how, how come, how come, that's true. How, that's how true. come Norwegian people? Listen, listen. To the no, no, listen to I, say, look, I, I know how long I've been. I know how long I've been in America, right? A lot of people look at me. A lot of my African people look at me. They say I look American. They say I look at most people. That What's American? There's no such thing as American. They look like me. There's no I don't look like it. If I didn't tell you I was African, you would not know. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm not. I don't think you're going. But answer this question, please. Answer this. Okay. Norwegian people live up just as far north as some Eskimo people, or whatever you want to call them. Oh, you even have like some Eskimo type people that live in Norway and Sweden. Some of those are so-called indigenous people. So how come the Norwegians are light-skinned people, but they live at the same, they live at the same uh, longitude, I'm assuming the same latitude as Eskimos. How come they're not the same color? I don't know. Man. I'm not going to tell you something that, I don't know about. But man, I you know, mean, that, that proof right there. Of our environment. The, the sun don't make you. We're product of our environment. No, it's the not. white people that live in South Africa, the only reason why they live there is because it's cooler. White people then naturally it, they migrate to areas. white people are going to start. Then it's so, so cool. White people are going to be black here pretty soon. If it's so cool, folks been in Africa that lately they kind of don't white for hundreds of years and they still white. They yeah. still white paler than the white people in Africa. Yeah, they still white. You're saying you're, you're, you're I'm just saying like, yeah, they're, they're still white because. But you said it's cool down there. The original environment that they were in no was sense, white. This is like. And I bet, and I bet a hundred years from now, I know what I'm saying. white people now. Florida, they still have white. I know what I'm saying. Got white people in Florida who aren't turning black. Exactly. They are turning black. They are turning black. I said they are food. not turning black. Yeah, yeah right. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. It's hot down there. This bell also be like under you. That makes no sense. I mean, it's not can't make it dark. Obviously. So that means the white people down there is going to eventually start getting woolly hair <laughs> and turning black. The white people that have been living in you, South America. If you look at the South if you probably the thing is, now you, get you can't prove it. Like, I guarantee you, eventually, if they stay there long enough, their kids will. So you saying you come, will, so, you know? so that means you no, believe no, in evolution. Don't mix it with the Africans, though. Even, even, like, even like, if they didn't mix I'm with the Africans. Columbus, I'm not from Columbus, right? I'm from, I'm from the East Coast. But even the white people here are different. White people in Columbus are different. Yeah, they, they're white. All of them, they look so black. I mean, I've never seen that. Like, That's because most of them are black. I got to It's because of their environment. That's because of their environment. It's because of their environment. It's West Virginia. It's because their environment. That's right. West Virginia is redneck Israelite. That what? There's a lot of, a lot of hillbillies from West Virginia are they're, they're black people. And they look like white people, but they actually descend from black people. You ever heard of the black Irish? What's a, yeah, yeah, have you ever I heard of the black guy? I don't believe in color. I don't believe in color. Like, it doesn't have to. I, I don't. I don't. I don't judge people by color either. But what I'm telling you, white devil. And you got white devil. <laughs> no. I'm gonna explain something. I'm gonna show them how. It doesn't matter. Huh? It doesn't matter. Why they put that shit up if it don't matter? If it don't matter. No, but I thought when I was a kid. This is this when I was expecting to come back. So yeah. fucking white motherfucker, man. It's not it's it's long hair. He was no white. Matter, it's not, he was never it white. The true color, matter. nobody, to be honest, nobody on this earth. I doubt anybody on this earth. Nobody on this earth. It doesn't matter. It's his message that matters. Let me read the Bible. It goes back to what I said before. It's in the Bible. Yeah, but that's my point. The prince who translated it, he's going to translate it. I don't know what you're saying, man. I don't, man. Listen, first if we never left two. Africa, would you not white people? First like, Corinthians two and ten. But the Most High have revealed them unto us by His Spirit. For the Spirit searches all things, yea, the deep things of the Most High. Exactly. Now look, I'm gonna show you something deep. Now listen to this. It don't matter, but here this now, fucker is up all over. All right, hold on. Right, it doesn't matter. Oh, you know, hold your peace. Tell that shit to them. No, do you know who Michelangelo is? Do you, wait, do you know who Michelangelo is? Now hold on a second. It don't matter. Who Michelangelo is? He like the paint. Is he in your house? No, I'm listening. Do you know who Michelangelo is? He's still a homosexual. Who is Michelangelo? He's an artist. He's a famous. He painted the Sistine Chapel. If you go down to the 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 Italy and Italy, 
the, the whole Saint Chapel was painted by Michelangelo. I know this, And man. it was commissioned by a white person to who's paint. The, the, who was the white person that commissioned? Oh, shit. It was the, the Pope, the, the, um, the um, Italian Pope. So they're going to make it in the image of their own oh, people. It was yeah. in the 1400s. We know this. That's it what we're That's a good answer. They're going to make yeah, it in so, their own yeah, image. So that's if, what we're telling you. If a black person, but it's, look at it, it's Islam. Islam is different. And it's based so on your race. So you never see any white they took it out of the original image of black people and put it to their image of white people. We've been saying this. Right, you're you're an expert on booty weight. What's wrong with that? It's, it's falsehood. It's teaching falsehood. When, when the Lord ain't no white man. Let me read the scripture. The Lord's a black man. Let me read it. So it's falsehood. It's teaching a false image of the Lord. That's why it says we're all, in the scripture it says our Lord was crucified there also, meaning Americans, they putting up this filthy ass image of a goddamn Edomite, a so-called white person, who's a guy, who's according to the Bible, is a goddamn devil. He's a devil. You know what I'm saying? Man. You're going to start spreading racial hatred. That's not even racial hatred. The, the, the Lord is with that's racial that's hatred. hatred. That's, that's, that's the Lord is with it. That's hatred. The yeah. Lord is with racial hatred. The Lord is with killing. America, 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 the Lord is with it. It's me to. I was going to I thought that was the real deal. You know the Lord likes racism, right? So that's not hatred. I can't. Well, honestly, I can't tell you that's good or bad. Yeah. That's the only thing I can't tell you. But when you say somebody's skin, because that person is that person You got your head. We didn't say that. You got your head of America's ass, man. I'm saying is that when I was a kid, I thought that was fucking Jesus, man. Then I started doing reading and research to come find out I could fucking laugh. I had a, I had a dream before I knew the truth. That I had a dream. You can't comprehend that? Like, you don't get that? No, no this is, my thing is, like, here's my thing, right? This, this, this oh, is doesn't matter. Like I'm not a happy person. I'm just trying to explain something to you, right? It doesn't matter. Like, at the end of the day, it doesn't matter. For the idea that you have to do good because of what you died, there's going to be a reward is false. So the same thing you guys are teaching. It's, yeah, it's the people, same so thing. They gotta false. Pay for that. It's the same thing. They don't got to pay for that. The same thing you guys are teaching is the same thing they're teaching. It's the same message. So if no, it's not. Where, you can, where everybody gets that agree, it's going to be a better Oh, I'm reading the scripture. Where you keep on dividing, dividing this, oh, dividing But the Lord came happens. to divide. Hey, by what? He did not divide. Yes, he, the Lord came to divide. <laughs> You're talking about that. And he Man. said, the Lord said, I, I came. Said, I did he said, the Lord, the one you called Jesus said, I, I came not to bring peace, but division. I'm, I'm, I know a lot of religion, so for you to keep on dividing, dividing, The dividing, Lord came to divide. There's That's nothing about, no, it's not. It's not yes, it is. It's all through the Bible. That Lord right there? <laughs> yes. The no, Lord not that one. The horns. No, he came to, that one came to bring <laughs> everybody together. Okay? <laughs> The Catholic Church wants to bring right everybody there. together. This they want to form there. a new world order. You ever heard about the new world order? No such the Bible, man. God is against the new world order. There's no such thing as okay? new world order. Man. There is such thing as a new world order. You living in it right now in America. Right. If I get a hop on the plane, I go to Africa and live happily ever after. I, not, I don't have to worry about social security you number. Why'd why you come here then? Why'd you hear then? Why would I not be here? You want to be a willing so The whole point, see, the thing about it, the whole point is social security card. You got social security card. If you really know anything about this, there's a life that travel and to go around. They migrate. Like, so we migrate long term. Why would you say? No, he just said Israelites migrate. You migrate. No, yeah. no, no. But you said there's no Israelites in West Africa. No, I never said. I never said that. I never you just said cut yourself. You said that there's you the yourself. black people are not in Africa are not.